We have in New Zealand some of the most amazing, wonderful timber trees of the world. We suddenly discovered a lot of people were thinking about this possibility. Why not manage native forests for all of their values? What we're trying to do is find that sweet spot between, um, you know, you've got the farmers that are interested in growing grass and you've got the exotic forester that's growing trees for, for timber. We, we feel that there's a role there for natives and they can be integrated with the land uses and uh, they can actually enhance them. They don't have to be competing with them. A the light bulb went on and I thought, you know, you're spending all this money and effort turning what was productive land and you're giving it back to nature and making something sustainable for the future. You know, you're not mining the natural capital but actually regenerating it. Continuous cover forestry, that's what I'm trying to set up here. Uh, a, a forest that can be managed for a sustainable, forever supply of timber. Because it's a valuable resource, people will manage it and look after it. And part of looking after it is making sure it's healthy. What I like about Cassie's farm, it, it has the best of both worlds, you know. It has all the native bush up there, but it also is a viable farm. So when we restore a forest, we're not just planting trees and welcoming birds back. We are restoring the connection to, to enable everything that belongs there to thrive.